hello YouTube. It's been a long time. Although you've been seeing me constantly because I'm uploading all my dares of my big trip. But it's been a month since I've been on the bike. It's just been pissing down rain the whole time. It's been so bad. We've got our own vehicles bogged in our own driveway. Just by I moved slightly off so I could get the bike out one day. And the ute got bogged. Would you believe it? <laughs> It's been a nightmare of uh, bad weather, but anyway, I got my new screen within three days of ordering it from Hotel Gear in WA. It was here. They're brilliant Hotel Gear. It's a Puig Touring screen for the CB500X. And this is my first chance at checking it out. I actually need to show you something. First chance at checking it out since I got it. I've got it on the high position, leaning back in the middle. There's forward, middle, back to the middle position, high position, sort of in line with the contours of the front of the bike. I'm not sure what will be best. I'll have to try that. I'll try putting it straight up as well. See what works out for the best. Hey, okay. Oh, so far so good, but of course I'm not going at any speed. It seems to be giving me great protection actually. We'll see when we get out in the highway. I've got to go get some fuel and I've got to head over to the casino because Lismore still doesn't really have any shops and I need to get some electrical stuff. So, casino it is. Uh, yeah, poor Lismore. Still nowhere near back to normal. We even had another bloody flood warning this week. Just to set everybody on edge because the uh, ground is saturated, the rivers are still up. So yeah, it wouldn't take much. Anyway, let's get on with this test of this Puig. Is that how you say it? Puig? Puig screen, touring screen for the CB500X. So far so good. Right, well I forgot I was even doing the, uh, the test on the screen because it's so quiet. But 80 or so kilometers an hour, it's giving me a lot of protection. It's amazing. It's so good. All this time I've been on this bike, I never had a screen that totally protected me because I'm six foot four, six foot five, depending on who you want to believe. Or the fact that I may be shrinking as I get older, but anyway, I'm around that. So uh, it's not that easy to get coverage. Awesome. This is very good. So on the dusty roads in the summer I'll be able to put my visor up, get protection from that and still get air. Uh, yeah, we'll see what it's like on the highway in a few minutes. So far so good. And it's not raining, like that's just, these days that's a minor miracle, possibly even a major one. Right, here we go, let's check out highway speed. We would if we could. Anyway, like, this is really quiet. I'm so just amazed by how quiet this is. The coverage from this screen is excellent. Again, I'm testing the screen, I'm just riding along in this beautiful smooth silence. Put my visor up, I can get enough ventilation without 
getting my eyes blown out. I'm really pleased with this screen, I'm really pleased with this position so far. I might try other positions, but for the moment I'm just so happy with this, I don't really want to change it. Well done Puig for making this really well de designed screen. It spreads the air sideways and above and gives clear, clean air to my helmet. Brilliant. Very pleased with it. Can recommend, especially for tall people, maybe for slightly smaller, shorter people, without the uh, Hammer product screen riser, it would also be sufficient. There you go. That's my first ride with my Puig touring screen for the CB500X. Very happy with it. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. And if you've got one of these bikes, it's helpful to you. Uh, catch you on the next one. In the meantime, be safe and be happy. Cheers, folks. Oh, yeah, it's beef week. I forgot about being Casino Beef Week, I've been to millions of people here, nowhere to park.